Um, let's learn how to do assets. You know, assets like uh, JS files and um, your CSS. And we're also gonna okay. So serve assets. We're gonna have it in the public folder, or or you call it assets. It's totally fine. Uh, let's call it assets then. App dot use. Express static. The function is assets, and it's even assets. So we're gonna make dir, make dir assets. So we're good for that. So we're gonna create like a CSS file in there. So touch assets slash style.css. There we go. So we're gonna do like uh, body, background, red. Okay, so the red. And we're gonna introduce also partials. So let's create a new folder. New folder of views. Call this partials and yeah, partials are pretty easy. So let's create a partial. I should all put it in one spot, but it's easier. Yeah, let's go in your Let's call this head.ejs. Let's call this foot turn. Yes. And we're also gonna get rid of the ejs. We got shorter app set view engine. You can use the mustaches, uh, so all these guys are gone. You don't have to type in EJS no more. It makes our life so much easier. Okay. Uh, let's make the header. Uh, HTML, sorry. HTML. Paste. Footer. But post copyright 2015, so it shows. Uh, okay, next they're gonna create includes. So set sign include partials head and. Twitter. So this is just like PHP. Twitter. So it's an include. So it's like grabbing a piece of that. And now we're gonna do no demon. No demon app.js. Did not break, thank God. This guy didn't work because I didn't put any stuff sheets. Link. Let's rename this guy. Style.css. Yeah. Cool. Should be all red. Let's check the second page. The second page is I forgot what they're called. 
Um, the second page is called R1, I think. Posts. Problem that the slash try. There we go. See, see, it doesn't work for that one if you don't put slash because like, you have to know the file directory of your assets. But we're again, let me see if like uh, bootstrap works. So I'm gonna try some bootstrap CDN. Let's try that out. Let's see if I can grab it from here. Cool, I created a new uh, directive. Let's try that out. Go to home. Uh, let's do. Let's do a. Not uh, here. Focus div. Let's do a. Uh, jumbotron. Random. H1. Hi there. So Jumbotron, see if that works. Yeah, Jumbotron works. You can't see that. Yeah, it's working. Um, this container. I was in the middle, I should put the whole thing in the container. This project container. Hmm. Footer should be. I don't know. That is going to be all contained. Hmm. Okay. okay, after you get that, um, here then, and then I'll just make the footer. If this, I wouldn't have been done if it was like Jade. Next time we use Jade. Cool. And let's try. I'm gonna try. Oh yeah, post. That bootstrap apparently works. That's that. Cool. Oh, well, it's pretty awesome. Everything's working. Cool. So yeah, that's partials. So you create a new folder. Um, you you put in, use includes. Very similar to uh, PHP. And you mangle everything. So include the head, include the footer. So it's in a separate file. You could put in more folders, so it won't be as like messy. There's less code, so you can just like make this really small, and then you have, you don't have to do it again. Just one line versus like a lot more. So 
the goals and not repeat yourself. And this line is very important. Uh, uh, assets and this one is to get rid of the extension. Which is pretty cool. So you type out less two. So this is a GitHub. And so I'm done with this tutorial. Till next time, guys. Bye.